Hello everyone, I am Divya, your math facilitator and welcome back to the channel. So firstly, let me tell you that I have posted in community asking your doubts. So I asked you to send me your doubts in email. Okay, so I gave you my mail ID also there, facilitatormath at the rate of gmail.com. So you can post me the doubts there if you have any. So already few of them have posted the doubts and the very important doubt which I got is what is the sample paper question paper sample or model paper for 2023 okay so let me clear this point first of all your essay one was two papers if you remember do you all remember essay one was two papers now essay two should actually be for one paper government said that essay one we are connecting two papers but essay two we will conduct it only for a single paper as a single paper okay so single paper model is already given in 2021 okay so let me discuss that model with you because you are going to get 80 marks paper 99 percent as of now that is the only information we have that you will have a single paper okay and keeping all the covid uh, you know situations around the world right now so even i am considering that you will have only single paper this year also okay so yeah now how is that single paper going to be and how is that going to help you a lot let me tell you in my opinion this paper will help you a lot okay so let me tell you how and if in case if there is any change in the pattern of question paper i will again update you with the change right now government has declared that it is going to be only one single paper and it is going to be an 80 mark paper for you okay instead of 40 and 40 it is 80 now also if there is any change i will definitely update you okay so let's begin with the session so let me tell you that yes as i told you this is 2021 model paper which we got when it was first time 80 mark paper okay and the same model will proceed now also and here you will have part a and part b so part a is going to be 60 mark and part b 20 mark okay and under part a you have section 1 and under section 1 you have group a and group b section 2 under section 2 there are no groups then section 3 you have group a and group b clear till here okay so part a part b is a division part a under part a you have section 1 2 3 in section 1 and 3 you have group a and group b in detail i'll explain you what what are these sections all about so in section 1 okay you have two mark question in section 1 you have two mark questions okay and you should answer three questions from each group now as i told you you have group a okay and you have group b in section 1 right so in group a you can see you have total of how many questions six questions so out of six questions you will answer only three got my point and in, in group B, you can see there are 3 plus 3, 6 questions. Out of these 6, again, you will answer only 3. Is it clear? So, total I should answer 6 questions. Okay. Out of that, I will answer 3 questions from group A and 3 questions from group B. Okay. So, if you see, it is a 50-50 choice here you have. Okay, out of 6, you will answer 3 and out of group B6, you will answer 3. These are 2 mark questions. So, total you will be gaining how many? 12 marks here. Okay, in section 1. Now, proceeding to section 2, you will answer any 4 questions in section 2. Any 4 questions. And each question carries 4 marks. Okay, you will answer any 2 and each question carries how many marks? 4 marks. Clear? Any 4 you will answer, each question carries 4 marks. So, total 16 marks for section 2. Now, in this, there is no group A, group B. Okay, in section 2, there is no group A, group B. You are given a total of 8 questions as you can see here from question number 13 to question number 18. So, total how many questions are there? 8 questions. Out of 8, you should answer only 4. So, here also if you see, it is a 50-50 choice. Clear? Out of 8, any 4. Now, let's proceed to section C. In section C, it is 8 marker questions. You should answer any 2 questions from each group. So, you have group A and group B. Group A contains 4 questions. Out of these 4 questions, you will answer how many questions? Only 
two questions. Group B also contains four questions out of which you will answer only two questions. Okay. So here also you can see there is a 50-50 choice. Okay. Out of four you will answer only two. So it is again a 50-50 choice. So is it very clear till here? This is all about your part B. So you have section 1, section 2, section 3. Section 1 has group A and group B. Section 3 has group A and group B. Section 1 carries two mark questions. Okay, these are two mark questions. These are four mark questions and these are eight mark questions. Okay, and in group A you should answer three questions. Group B you should answer three questions. Here out of the four mark questions you will answer four questions. Okay, total eight will be given. Here you will answer two questions from group A, two questions from group B. Total four and four questions will be given. Okay, so in total you can see 3 plus 3, 6, 10, 14 questions you have to answer in the question paper in part A and you will have 28 questions, double the number is given to you in part A. Okay, so now see, now as I told the complete part A is 50-50 choice. Now if you come to part B, okay, scroll down to part B, you see it is 20 marks paper, okay, and each question carries one mark here so easy and all the questions are all the questions are multiple choice question okay you need to choose the correct answer all of them are multiple choice question all 20 questions so you need to answer all the 20 questions all of them are multiple choice clear so this is the question paper pattern given to you uh, in 2021 and this was followed last year okay so this year maximum you will have single paper if it is a single paper most probably it is the same question paper pattern which is going to be followed if there is any change i will definitely update you and okay let me tell you the time for this paper is 3 hour 15 minutes is given to you for this 80 mark paper and trust me it is sufficient also and also let me also tell you if you have any doubt please post me in the telegram group okay so telegram you can uh, text me personally also all the links are given to you in the uh, description of this video also you can text me in instagram or you can send me a mail on my mail id facilitatorman.com and i will be starting revision classes for you for your pre-finals so let me tell which topic you need you want me to start first for your pre-final examinations also ap students have their essay one from january so you can simultaneously AP and TS students can simultaneously see the revision sessions given to you. So tell me which topics you need first in the comments below. Okay. And any update which I get, I'll definitely post it to you first. Okay. So don't forget to subscribe to the channel. And thank you so much for loving the channel so much for so many years. And yes, we will be giving you most important questions starting from tomorrow. So stay tuned and let me know your requirement in the comment box so that I can start that chapter first. Okay, majority will be taken into consideration. So thank you so much. Bye bye. Take care and share this video with all your friends as well. Thank you.